A warning tonight about aggressive bandits targeting homeowners in the western suburbs. Good evening. I'm Rob Johnson. And I'm Erica Sargent. The burglars recently hit several homes in Bensonville. CBS 2's Brad Edwards is live in Bensonville with our original report on how some homeowners caught them in the act. Yeah, good evening, Erica and Rob. A stolen car, laptops, TVs, and more. Residents tonight are making some noise in a place used to a different type of clatter. Where the planes typically roar to 35,000. We scared. We scared leaf over here. Within moments of our arrival, I'm afraid to go out at night. A group of residents gathered to talk about what they've all talked about. In the last few weeks, I've installed uh, a security system. I've installed 24 hour lighting system around my house. It just scares me. I don't even let my dog out at night. You know, it just, it kind of like puts a fear in you. Police sent out an alert to residents that on one day alone, January 13th, they're investigating four residential burglaries, two successful, two attempted. Tonight, police sent us a possible suspect vehicle, a silver four-door sedan, potentially a Chevy Malibu. As we neared the end of our interview, just Tuesday, we learned. Because she was face to face with the guy who tried to rob her house. The area is becoming really dangerous right now. His wife came face to face with a would-be burglar. He was literally uh, grabbing the door. He was trying to get in. So she saw him face to face. Thank God she had a phone in her hand. So she, got, she started screaming. She said, I'm going to call the cops. And then he took off. Off and into the darkness under their street lights that doesn't work. Police tell us tonight they are indeed working some leads, including that picture, which may be key. They tell us as many as four suspects were in that vehicle. We're live tonight in Bensonville. Brad Edwards, CBS 2 News. Erica. All right, Brad, thank you.